no one. I can't. No one. Can't. It's just like clicking and shit. Like. Well, the like. That's the, racist. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's racist. All right, let's jump on this shit. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to. I can't even say another. <laughs> just, just say. Hey. <laughs> let's just say. To let's say. To welcome show. to the. Ta- you've probably never heard of us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to this tasteless gentleman show, which the, is the what we like to call it. Yeah. <laughs> the new and improved. New season format. Season one. <laughs> yeah. Season one, episode one. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it, it's been like two months. It's longer. Three than that. Yeah. It's been longer. Two than years. That. We all died and came back. Oh man, I blacked out. <laughs> oh shit. Like yeah. Jesus rising. Getting so from many messages. Oh, I'm sure. Bro, yeah. Yeah. That's I'm all sure. I get is that. Just much appreciated, yeah, though, yeah, to I, be honest. I, like, I'm yeah. complaining, but not really. No, not really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I like, feel bad. I'm they like, used to be, like, just straight up, like, fuck you guys, do a show. And now it seems to be more respectful. Yeah. Like, hey, guys. hey, I understand this is your business <laughs> page, <laughs> but I just wanted to say I really enjoy the show, yeah, right. and I'd like it if you guys would do more. Thank oh, you very much. By Have the way, a great day. hurry the fuck up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hashtag fuck scoop. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Those keep coming. And I saw somebody use that as a uh, just the other day use that for discount code. Nice. I was like, damn, still on. Do you it. get to see whenever they input discount codes? I mean, I don't, I don't go through them, but no, I, but you can see. Oh yeah, you can yeah, see yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Should we introduce ourselves? So I know who we are. I was going to. This is uh, Dom. <laughs> <laughs> and this is Alex. Return of the Mac. And this is Scoop. <laughs> and and this here is Ziggy. He's and, back. And I'm me. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> what the fuck do you want to talk about since the last time we got together on these couches? Uh, yeah, I don't even, I can't remember I the last I have no 20 shows. I couldn't I tell you one thing we talked about. No, but no. we should talk about Dwight Howard. Dwight Howard just, or Dwight just around just your j- lips? <laughs> just <laughs> jiggling <Both>. dick. <laughs> so, the story is that he is he, a 6'11 bottom. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, it's a power bottom, okay? <laughs> oh, wait, so, wait, is he, is, is that the story that he's taken? I heard he's taken. Well, he can't give when you're that big. Wait, we gotta Why give, not? you gotta give the backstory, though. What the fuck happened? What? He was dating like some transgender. Well, he was dating multiple dude. people, yeah, and he multiple. got ca- he got caught up by some ch- some woman that he was dating, like a real woman. Oh, oh, oh! Uh, we can't say I, that. I, whoa, I, whoa, no. whoa, 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 whoa! It was a oh, nigga wh- with a wig. Oh, wh- Correction. <laughs> <laughs> you can say that though. <laughs> In all, in all fairness, that could have been a black woman with a wig too. So. <laughs> wow. Um, so he was dating some chick, and they were like, he met on IG. He slid in the DMs, obviously, as you do. You can't do that when you're famous, though. No, you that's can't. what. Why are you doing that? Yeah. yeah how so, else? Yeah. yeah. What do yeah. you mean? How? Well, else? You so, have an assistant well, of an yeah, assistant right. do it for you. Walk the streets. Yeah. So, so <laughs> yeah. apparently, fucking leave your house. <laughs> apparently, he had met her at some like award show or something like that. And they were following, they followed, they're talking, and then they yeah. followed each other on IG, and then he slid in the DMs. And she thought they were having like a full on relationship, and he, she would like travel to wherever they were on the road. This is, this is the, 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 the female. Th- no, no, that, no, this is, that's the, the female. Yeah. Well, no, no, there was then, no then she, she found out about this one, found out about the female, because okay. this one, is, uh, he gave her an STD. Wait, you got, okay, fu- uh, hang on. Uh, <laughs> he fucking DMs this chick. This is the chick we're talking about. Yeah. Who is, she's a legitimate female. She's not. She was like an IG model or some shit okay. like that. Yeah. And he's flying her back, she's flying back and forth wherever he's at, fucking him. Yeah. Well, not at every single stop whatever. on the road, but yeah, like some stops on the road and or she, whatever. You, okay, so and she, she thinks like, it's a relationship. Yeah, she thought it was going towards a relationship, and they were That's like. That's her bad. Yeah, no, yeah. right? Especially if you're dating, you're a chick and you're fucking a famous, yeah. a fucking athlete. Yeah, you, athlete. Be, you better lay it down and text, are we dating? Yeah. Well, no, you can't do that. Yeah. That's the problem. Is that when yeah. you got that much power, they can't. You can't exactly. do that. Yeah. But hey, you you, you, you walk yourself into that trap if you don't get if you don't get the uh, the, the confirmation. I can't. Okay, let's just. I mean, I don't want to derail this, but if you if it was the other way around, and a girl was flying you out all the time. I mean, I guess guys wouldn't be like, "Are we in a relationship?" But it would I'd be, be like, cool, more I'm free flights. <laughs> yeah, 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 me too. But, but at the same time, it is still more than just like some chick I fuck. If she's flying you to to Toronto while she's there for one it, night, it, it would depend on what she was doing. Yeah. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah. If she's you're playing for the it, Spurs, it, yeah. many <laughs> flights she's, does she's, not a relationship yeah. make. If she's playing yeah. for if she's playing for the LA Sparks or whatever it is, <laughs> first off, she can't afford tickets. Yeah, no, no, no. no, no okay, no. but so, but beyond that, like if um if if a dude's in the NBA, just assume he's fucking everything. Yeah, why not? Okay, that, so that's that chick. Yeah. Yes. Okay, now w- let's continue with whatever else. So is. she got an STD from Dwight Howard. What did she? What STD was she? Uh, I don't know. She didn't say what it was. At least uh, not what I read. Um, but she and then like Dwight Howard's pastor 
and like a bunch <laughs> of his like PR people or when you know what people who work for him and shit were like threatening her trying to get her to keep silent fucking pastor and, yeah of course yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's yeah, christianity yeah, right oh, there. oh i'm not <laughs> questioning that i'm just kind of mildly yeah. surprised he took time away from touching boys to go fucking <laughs> yell at a fucking ig model <laughs> yeah are you yeah. sure this isn't the shemale because the she-mail, th- this isn't is the literal story that she was saying sent- before we continue the story somebody right, fucking right. fact check this shit it was the she it, it was, was the she- okay, yeah, I, yeah, I listened yeah, yeah. to her on twitter she she did the whole thing did she have a voice like that no she did not no really yeah yeah yeah, she kind of looks like one. She just put him on blast yeah. on the okay, phone. Okay, well then she. Yeah. But did she catch him with somebody else? Yeah, yes. he was yeah, at like okay with another at, with another uh, some she sex party. Yeah, yeah, some she male sex party. Oh, there was that. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So maybe but that's she, what it was. So she posted the uh, like a screen capture, but like a screen video capture, and then people didn't believe that of like their whole conversation, not the whole thing, but a long bit of their conversation. Where'd people she post it? Twitter. Uh, Twitter. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So people didn't believe that, and then she had someone else, uh, you you know, like record her phone. You know, with their yeah, camera, yeah. so that you could see, like she's swiping. This isn't some made up shit. Yeah, you know? yeah. And then it's his profile and all this. And that, yeah, that's what she was saying that okay. she was getting flown out and all this. And then she was just dropping dimes. And she was posting other uh, she male. Can you even say that? Dude, the one in the one from Fuck it, uh, so yes. There was like some sex parties in like in like Atlanta or some shit that uh. he was going to. And like, dude, that that tr- that that ch- fucking trans chick was fucking. Disgusting. Yeah, there were a yeah. couple that were <laughs> wrong. Oh my god, if dude! You're, I mean, I, I don't. I mean, I, I'm not in that world. But if you're famous, I feel like you get cream of the crop. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, not the one that's fucking slinging out five dollar hand jobs yeah. on the blade. I'm like, <laughs> big dick bitch dot com. Big dick bitch dot com. Like you gotta get cream of the crop. I don't. I just don't understand. Like if you're gay, you, you're not fucking ugly dudes when you got money. Fucking gay. Fucking gay. <laughs> <laughs> So wait, uh, so he, so there were no actual. I thought that one was a, was a chick. I didn't. There may be a chick involved in yeah. there, but I just know that the everything you just said was like I heard her say. Yeah, yeah she was saying that shit. Yeah, she was saying those exact things. She was like on the phone. She was like, "You wanted me to suck your dick, and you suck mine, <laughs> Dwight. You wanted me to fuck you in the ass, Dwight. Wait, you wanted me to cover your mouth, Dwight. Why did this all? Like, why uh, did all this? Why did all this that. come out? Because she was threatened. Yeah, because yeah. I, his I his camp threatened her. Well, so she was saying she wanted to come out because they were like. You know, she's getting death threats from oh, people she, it in got, his, I didn't know it got that serious. Yeah, from people in his, you know, entourage or whatever the fuck. So, and they, you know, he was sending messages. Dwight was like, we know where you live. You know, we're out. I have somebody outside your house. And then she saw people that were, like, in a car. So, she's like, I just wanted to get this out there because I don't want to get because <laughs> I died. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I want the truth to be known if I get killed. <laughs> dude, when you have it, I feel like if Man. you're an NBA player and you have money like that, somebody will kill yeah, somebody for, sure. for you. And, yeah. he, and he's a bottom. No wonder he was so soft and down low. <laughs> <laughs> it all started making sense, yeah. man. All those jokes. Come, yeah, dude, God, Twitter dude. was on fire. <laughs> oh, my God. They were crushing the poor Wait, man. Wait, how did it? Oh, she revealed that he was a bottom? That's what she was saying? Mm-hmm. He was like, you want me to fuck you in the ass? Dude, the, the softest 6'11 <laughs> big man to ever play. Yeah. The game. It makes Six, it all makes so much sense. Six now. eleven bottom and like yokes it. too. Yeah. <laughs> I to me the because if you can look this up on YouTube or in a bunch of places, but multiple times he's grabbed dude's dick on the like on the bench. Like as a joke. Or when they're like huddling and shit. Yeah, right? yeah. and you like grab their ass, but not like it's like when you grab your girl's ass and you get the whole you, when, you're, when you're cupping. Are you more than cup? I mean you could you could pull it off like fucking pulled pork. <laughs> you're just grabbing the whole well, not, not, thing. Not everybody has your massive hands no, though. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, but you can get a good, you know, good yeah, grip yeah, yeah. and ah, especially you go with a fat ass. But uh yeah, he was doing shit like that to dudes. Like so it's funny if he's not sucking wieners. Yeah. <laughs> Or trying to get his wiener sucked, yeah. or taking like, it, or taking it in the ass. But that's funny that double standard though. It's like if if your buddy just like hits you in the dick, you're like ah. But yeah. if he's gay, but, but if he's it. gay, you're like get your fucking hands <laughs> off me. <laughs> Don't touch me, you, you swine. T- you uncultured swine. Well, because one's I, I, a I joke. Can... The other one might mean, hey, I want to suck your dick. Yeah. 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 I, I can imagine how excited he was to get in the showers and fuck around with everybody. And they all just thought, he's like, oh, there's Dwight Howard yeah. fucking around. Just, yeah. just, being, just being Dwight Howard. He's just jerking. He never drives with a towel. <laughs> who was it? Who was it? Charles Haley, who was a defensive end on the Niners and the, in the, in the uh, Cowboys, was known for, like, apparently he would, like, in the locker room, just pull his dick out. 
and just start jacking off like to like Joe Montana, like right in front of Joe Montana. And he would start talking about like Joe Montana's mom and he's just jacking his own dick off. That's a kid who was abused. Yeah. I was going to say that you're a half step <laughs> away from like doing some really fucked up shit. If yeah. Well, that's that. the reason why he didn't get in the, into the um, hall of fame until super late because he was just such a fucked up human being. Makes sense. Is he still alive? I wonder. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. He's still making appearances around the Niners. Oh, shit. Probably drives uh, yeah. a box Chevy in Oakland. Oh, he probably he probably can't <laughs> even walk too. <laughs> I mean, I saw Hammer on the sidelines of fucking the Warriors game. How does that guy still have money? MC Hammer, he yeah, invested MC in real Hammer. estate. Did he? He lost well, everything. Know, <laughs> that could be. Yeah. No, the, he, he, some company hired him to do commercials not that long ago because I saw he? one. Uh, it was within the last like three or four years. Dude, he did the most Oakland thing ever when he got famous when he bought the fucking helicopter, helicopter from the yeah, Oakland the police, police department. Yeah, yeah, I mean that's like that's gangster. <laughs> That's some shit I do. And they paid it <laughs> Matt Black with fucking camel paint. Yeah. You know what I mean? For no reason. For no can't even fly yeah, in you the can't city. Even. <laughs> if Dom ever has money, everything he owns is going to be Matt Black camo. Yeah. His whole fucking house is going to be Matt fucking whole, camo. Yeah. The whole interior of the helicopter is bronze. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, like, you can't, can't even, even fly, fly it. No. <laughs> it's too fucking heavy. Yeah, <laughs> like, shit is sick. <laughs> Was there anything else the Dwight Howard thing? I feel like there was a little bit. I I just saw so many girls that that chick posted. Wait, is he still in the league? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He yeah. plays for the uh, Washington Rats fucking. I know he's been bullets. like bouncing around. Not bullets like, anymore? Aren't they? I don't know. Is he getting the bullets? Is he getting released and like trade and like moved around, or is I he think actually he like got, playing? He got in, he got an injury this week. That's oh, he's out. For yeah, yeah. No, but yeah. Well, you got a duck, bro. <laughs> like, I, no, no, I don't. Yeah, I don't yeah. blame him. Pop <laughs> smoke and just disappear for a little bit, bro. Yeah. This might even be retirement. Like, <laughs> that's, oh, that's, that's when you get the 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 weird thing where like oh he has family uh, issues or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, he's, he's a leave of absence from the team because he's got to deal with family problems. Yeah, he, he, he's going to Europe for. He does have family issues. Yeah. You imagine this all coming out in the news? Was he married? No, no, no. Does he have kids, oh, that, he have kids or anything? Yeah, that's what she yeah, said. Yeah, eight kids. He had eight, well, how many? Eight kids. No. Eight? Yeah, yeah, no, we yeah, didn't. That's, that, that's a little low for the NBA. Yeah, yeah. Are you serious? Yeah, he got eight kids. Eight? Yeah. I think, I'm pretty sure, all different baby mamas. Man, sometimes, stere- sometimes stereotypes. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, if I was rich, I'd have bad kids. <laughs> this well, dude is out here fucking. Yeah. All he does is fuck. <laughs> Wait, what were you saying about half? What's that? I think we started to talk about the first. Oh, that was Scotty. I asked Scottie if he was married. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Yeah, but oh, 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 one sec, though. So yeah, yeah. he has eight kids, <laughs> and he, he's obviously, I mean, uh, gay dudes fuck like crazy, and he's fucking chicks. Of course he has a fucking STD. Like, how does his dick even work? How does it shoot that many ropes? That's why he's a bottom. Because he shot all the ropes? He's, he's tired, yeah. He's tired. I have a question. You, you can only get so many erections in your lifetime. Yes. I have, he's a, damn near I have out. a valid yes. question. So, in the realm of, like, gay dudes who fuck chicks, if you're really gay, like, really gay and you're attracted to men, how do you stay and get hard fucking a chick? I don't know. Like, I, I, th- someone I was hanging out with the other day, we were talking about this, and it, I'm like, that's a fucking valid question. Well, you could be bisexual. Yeah, that means, yeah I but I mean, that's... if you're really, because a lot of, like, really, truly gay men will have wives for years that I'm sure they're fucking, you know, until they decide to ultimately come I'm out of the closet. Sh- I'm sure a gay dude could get you hard if you really tried. I don't know. <laughs> I, I really don't know. <laughs> All right, on the next hey, episode, bl- on, the, on the next episode, Bradley gets jerked off by a gay dude. No, but I mean that's a legitimate. <laughs> do you really think you could get hard? Like, do you really think that a gay, a man could get you hard? Honestly, it, I don't know. Like, what? Like, if you're looking down at some fucking hairy, sweaty dude, and he's like talking dirty to you while he's got it, his it, fucking. It, it, it wouldn't. It wouldn't turn me on. But it, like, if if you were determined to do it, I guess you could. And you had a blindfold on, probably. And no, dude, I'm talking you, no blindfold. You get a hard on this. fucking knocking into the, the, the fucking... You run into the wall. Yeah, it's on accident. You're like, you, you, you ride a bike too close with your legs, yeah. you get a fucking hard on. Wear sweatpants <laughs> and go over some speed bumps. Yeah. That's, that's, why I never, that's why I never want a massage from a dude. Yeah. Like, I know a friend that got one. You I was afraid like, to just, get a boner? Yeah, yeah, I don't want to get a boner. I'm like, is that... It's a that boner. Point, was that, that, wasn't that Seinfeld, George Costanza? He's like, it moved. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, w- I just don't want those hands all over. Yeah. Just man hands. But they're stronger. They can get in there deep on that deep tissue massage. Oh, I don't know. I've had some females give me massages. And I was like on the verge of crying. They were just fucking digging their elbow into my I, back. I, I, don't, I don't even like getting like super oh, I love rough massages. Shit. I had one in Thailand. She wanted, I was going to fucking cry. She was like yeah. five foot two. And oh, like, was she walking on you? Yeah, she's yeah. doing all that shit. 
Like, oh, I, my God. Honestly, if I would go to one of those, I would literally just be, I don't care about anything else. Just jerk me off. I was about to say, I went to Japan <laughs> and got a massage. And I know, but that, off. that's, you're Have, playing a so, game. I've, I've never, I want to do that at some point. I What's it she, like? I thought she liked me, so I was super stoked. What's it like? I, was it like the Hooters waitress? <laughs> no, 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 no. It was a massage the stripper. Part, but, <laughs> yeah. I think she likes me. Yeah. 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 Yeah, she likes me. She keeps asking me to go in the room with her. No, no, no. Trust me. This is different. Wait, I want to hear about this because I've often, I've, I'm gonna do this at some point in my life, and I yeah, want to yeah. know what it's like. As you should. I mean, the one I went to, like, uh, you set you on the table, fucking, she puts all this oil on you, and then like, I don't know, she's like barely clothed herself. She just gets on top, you start massaging. Then she but like, was she wearing like underwear? Yeah, was she I, wearing yeah, a bra, like, like yeah. lingerie? What was yeah, she? Like lingerie kind she of. She cute. Okay. Yeah, yeah, she was decent. I mean, Japan. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to. I, 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 I just want to. Racist. <laughs> I just want to do it. I just want to do it because I want them to like w- clean up the the jizz like a, like I'm a baby. <laughs> you know? uh, <laughs> you know? Well, Bro. like you wanted to put you pin your legs up and fucking no, wipe like, like, you not like, like not, that not with like, a baby wipe. Not like that, but like you know, because you, like, where are you gonna bust your nut? Like it's gonna be on on you probably. In the air, in the atmosphere. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Scoop goes like this, like no, he's waving. Yeah, because none of it comes back down. It's yeah. like it's like Spider Man rope. It just shoots up to the ceiling. Okay, wait, wait. <laughs> I want to. Okay, so she's. Luke, like, did you get a massage before she jerked you off? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get the whole, like, the whole body massage. See, that sounds fucking insanely pleasurable. The, the best thing, the best part about it was, like, when she's on your back and she's, like, naked and she's, like, rubbing her oh, body yeah. on yours. Skin on skin? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. That you was feel amazing. hard nipples, like diamonds? Yeah, little bullet nipples. <laughs> <laughs> did, did she have a bush, though? Uh, she, didn't, she didn't get naked or nothing. Uh, yeah, so yeah, just yeah, topless? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like, kind of topless. And then, and then at the end, man, you know what I mean? The whole... <laughs> but I mean, are you are you butt naked laying there? Or yeah, you have like yeah, a towel yeah. over oh, you, you and she yeah. underneath did, did the she, towel. Did she just say roll over and then she like just went under the towel? Like Yeah, we ha- she has a towel on. I mean, you have a towel on and like as massage is going, you know, she kinda eases okay, her Okay, big boy. Oh. Eases her hand. And then you, you know make know little like, noises. Ooh. Yeah, you go, ooh, watch the you're, gooch. You're, <laughs> you're you're in Japan. She probably thought you were an NBA player. Yeah, probably. She probably thought you were like, Dwight. Oh, you Michael Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> like that Ray this Ray? area like this area feels good. If you've ever actually just had the fucking yeah. your inner thigh massage. But I tell you what, man, she made me come faster than I could make myself come. Really? really? Yeah. No shit. Why? Jet speed. Just <laughs> somebody somebody get this woman a medal. Yeah. Like she's got shit to do. Okay, yeah. but legitimately she's faster jerk than off a you lot could. More dudes. Absolutely. Like wow. for real, for real. Like how quick are we? Are we talking like 20, 30 seconds? I'd say like a minute and a half too. Damn. Was she like speedy or was yeah, just yeah. she it just like, had the take? Or were you, I was all or lubed you, up. Or you just kind of shocked when it happened. I was shocked though too because I thought yeah. she liked me. Like I said, I was like, hell yeah, I'm getting that extra boy. <laughs> Wait till I tell my friends about this one. Yeah, she's <laughs> like four fifty. <laughs> Fucking pay up. And then your boys are like, oh yeah, she jerked me off last week. Yeah. Or <laughs> earlier. <laughs> yeah. Oh, fucking, oh, right before you. <laughs> the massage parlor is called We Jerk You Off. <laughs> Isn't there a chain one called Happy Head? Yeah, yeah, happy yeah, head. Yeah, yeah. yeah, happy head reflexology. They yeah. do like yeah, the head scalp massages. Oh, that's what it is. Yeah, yeah. I, I just assumed it was getting jerked off. I mean, <laughs> me too. I know, <laughs> dude. If you drive around, especially in this area, you see those little massage parlors in those oh, shitty fucking strip malls. Sure. But, I know they do it. But who's they're, they're, jerking? Like, how do you ask for that? Like, no, is there a code word? There's, there's a there's a like a Yelp for this. Yeah, yeah. There's an app. That's, is it? Yeah. yeah, it's like legit. What I do mean, you search on Yelp? I can't. Remember. No, it's not. It's not. A, it's not Yelp. It's a like a style of Yelp. Oh, okay. It's like jerk maps or something. Like no <laughs> joke. I'm not kidding. It's something like that. And I people really have like re- jerk maps. Here, here's where you can jerk off, and here where you can get jerked off. <laughs> yeah, it's something like that though. I like, can't remember. Like ask the name. for fucking cami or something. It, it pretty much is like people have reviews and like this spot was oh. all right. Not that's that's awesome. awesome. Um, there used to be this place on El Cajon Boulevard that was like this disgusting fucking like uh like like a uh, bathhouse and it was like a, a russian bathhouse kind of, of yeah, yeah but like you would rent out like a private room that had like a two-person jacuzzi tub in it dude anything hot and steamy that's open to the yeah. public is so gross to and, me. and this is on el Cajon boulevard nice. over by state oh. yeah. which is like staff the only way i'm walking HIV. into a place that you can rent out something like that is if it's in la jolla yes or maybe downtown del mar, del del mar, mar yes. like other than that the funny thing is there was some like mtv dating show where like they went that was one of the spots they went on the date and i was like oh that's fucking disgusting <laughs> dude yeah, that's There's one like in Hillcrest, it, and I didn't even know about it until I was out with some gay dudes, and they're like, "Oh yeah, it's a bathhouse right there." You just, I, we stood there like I was smoking a cigarette, and we were watching, I and thought, like people, dudes going in and out. Just, I thought the bathhouse was the trails on Balboa Park. That's a different area. <laughs> <laughs> what was that called? The Circle of Pleasure or something? I forget the name of it. I don't know. If you want to figure out if you can get hard, we can go there right what now. What is a bathhouse though? Wait, wait, is I, what I think it I is. I didn't finish asking. 
Oh, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, what, okay, so she jerks you off. You you just came on yourself or what? Yeah, you just come on yourself and, and then she, like, she just holds you down. See, I want to know what he was talking about. Did she like? Yeah, she like holds me back down and then <laughs> fucking threw me to town. <laughs> fucking holds you down. Like just <laughs> da, 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 she holds you down. Yeah, did yeah. she mop? Nah. Did like she, she sprayed the she carpet. Sprayed water nah, it wasn't carpet. It was all tile. It was like the whole thing was like a big ass shower. Oh, I've been. Uh, I've done that before. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, and then oh, uh, and then you got and saw a slippery. Yeah, you got to get your shower shoes on. That's so disgusting. <laughs> shower <laughs> shoes. Oh, and then that know. was it. That was it. You that asked what what was the bathhouse, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. What, it, there's a bunch of different styles of bathhouse, like in Europe, like that. It's legit. It's not. Yeah, like, it's <laughs> no. It's there's nothing shady about yeah, it. It's like it's like steam rooms with like what like rock, rocking yeah, chair kind yeah. of things you sit in. I think it's like bathhouses in Europe are kind of like gyms here. Yeah, yeah, they're nice. Yeah, and then. And there's like uh, they have a bunch of shit there. Like in Russia, they do this thing with these leaves. I'm sure somebody in our comments will. So, but it's like uh, you basically get a massage and they hit you with these oh, leaves yeah, yeah, and yeah. shit. Yeah. And like, it's supposed to feel really good. I don't know. But yeah, uh, you guys ever seen the movie Eastern Promises? Yep. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah the yeah, scene yeah. with fucking Vigo in the bathhouse. Yeah, in the bathhouse. That's one he, of the greatest when he, when scenes he's, ever. When he's killing two dudes yep. while he's naked. Yep. Like that's that's a bathhouse, right? Yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Typical bathhouse yeah. behavior. <laughs> but I think Typical here, Russian bathhouse. Yeah, what, what are they here? Just all politicians and gay dudes fucking. That's yeah. all it is. Everyone's in there sucking and fucking. By the way, politicians and gay dudes is the same thing. Yeah, fucking. Same thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like a big steam room. Uh, basically, there can be small pools or like a pool or and it's, like, it's all warm water. So it's like a, a spa that you pay to go in and fuck dudes. Yeah, yeah when I was like, there's only dudes in there. Yeah, when I was like 16. They, uh, the YMCA that I used to live by uh, in San Francisco. So we already know where this is going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I just didn't know, and I uh, uh, I worked out, and then uh, I was like, oh, like I've never been in a steam room. I this is where Scoop been... reveals how he was molested. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I think yeah. I might have been 14, though. Was, wasn't the y, uh, YMCA uh, bathhouses and bathrooms like notorious cruising place yeah, for yeah, gay yeah. dudes? Like... But, so I didn't know, So and I'd never really been. I, might, I think I was 14. And I just remember walking in, and it was just all dudes. <laughs> and I'm like, I mean, obviously, you know, it's like it's, it's in the bathroom, but – I just, and I don't know, something just didn't feel right, and they're all sitting close. And I'm like, what the fuck is going <laughs> Like, I'm getting the fuck out of here, dude. This is gross. This oh, is shit. Gross. But, yeah. <laughs> and uh, so, Scotty Pippen, another basketball player, is uh, he's fucked up. Getting divorced now, man. They're finally getting Wasn't divorced. Wasn't he married for a long time, though? Yeah, and Future fucked his wife, and he stayed with her, and then she got caught up. Oh, we completely forgot about that whole and Future thing. We talked about that. Like, yeah. When did he fuck his wife? Huh? When did Future fuck his wife? How long ago was that? Uh, oh, it was a while I'm, ago. I'm not sure, yeah. yeah. Dude, so, then she's not. She ain't getting shit if you what? got adultery. That, that, doesn't, that doesn't matter. That, really? Yeah, that, that whole, you're not allowed to bring adultery into the divorce anymore. Since when? Long. It's been a long time. Yeah. Wow. It's such bullshit. Such bullshit. Yeah, she's I don't want to hear women say anything about how this is a patriarchy. I don't <laughs> fucking ever want to hear it again, dude. <laughs> the, the UK, if you corner them on like what is the patriarchy, oh, they yeah. can't give a fucking answer. I well, saw Jordan Peterson just fucking destroy that it's, it's, argument. It's, it's like if somebody it starts good. it starts with somebody starts talking about like the Illuminati or something like that. It's like what do you mean like who are these people? But yeah. that I I always thought that was like a slam dunk like if you commit adultery you're not entitled to jack shit. Doesn't mean That's like a super yeah. old thing. Uh, yeah. But I think I, that, I think I maybe think some states do that. They I don't know. should do that though. Like I'm I'm saying if they if if the reason why you're getting divorced is because she cheated or he cheated. Yeah, you get nothing. Then it you shouldn't like that that's a that's a break of the contract basically. I, I just I just think that like the whole like I I can understand if you're if you what you earn like after you're married, I can understand giving that per, the other person like a fair amount. It doesn't not have fifty. To, not Fuck 50. you. No, if no, you're no. not sitting on your ass no, doing no, nothing, no, you not, get dick. Not, not fifty, but like half. Yeah. <laughs> half. Half. I, dude, I just don't see. I mean, honestly, let's say I fucking married some really wealthy chick. I couldn't even look at myself in the mirror and go, "You're gonna take half." Oprah, I'm taking every dime I, I can I couldn't, get. I couldn't do <laughs> it. Yeah. Just like out of just Oprah being a man, killed. dude. I what couldn't was that? do it. She'll kill you. Oprah? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. No, you're not kidding? getting fucking jack shit. She'd narco me, fucking she'd gunman me, on deck. She'd give you ten million dollars. It wouldn't even be a drop in the bucket. But see, something like that's fair. Like. I, I, That's what I'm saying. Like, but the thing is that it gets sticky though. Like, if she was just a, if you got married, or let's just go with he, so we don't get all the anger, because it could go the other way too. Mm -hmm. Let's say dude's not worth. They get married, she's wealthy, and he's just sitting around not doing a fucking yeah, thing, you know, and not contributing when he has opportunities. <laughs> That's not the dream. And you have all these opportunities, 
and you're just sitting around not to, you shouldn't get anything like if you take care of the family you know you take care of her your personal assistant or whatever do yeah, something okay, fair enough like yeah. you deserve some money here something. Like, you're just gonna sit around and watch netflix and jerk off you're gonna just fuck future yeah <laughs> just fuck future. is she attractive yeah yeah, yeah. yeah she's pretty yeah, hot. I thought she's, so. yeah. she's older too and she's Bang. And, and he looks like Osama bin Laden. So. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah, he does, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Shit. That fool looks Middle Eastern as hell. He does. He does, and they're probably the same height. Yeah. Yeah. Osama. Hey, was, you never seen them in the same room together? Oh shit! <laughs> Where was Scotty on 9/11? I'll call the FBI. Oh shit! Where was Scotty? Oh, we need to look into it. Scotty, we do. Scotty, Scotty. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, she's banging though. I wonder when they got married. Like, uh, was it she was good looking? Though? It was probably when he was still relevant, right? Ish, no. Maybe, but maybe they're like He's high school. Been relevant for fucking ever, dude. Yeah, nineties, early nineties. You know who else looks good as a fucking older woman? I saw a photo recently. Gwen Stefani. Yes, she's gonna look I, good forever. I saw her following dude, her. Dude, she's like, I, really? I saw the Hell fucking yeah, caption and it was like, she said 50, she's fifty three. Like, Fuck, fifty three. Yeah. Bro. I mean, no joke. She could pass for like early twenties, uh, maybe up close. I'm yeah, sure yeah, she probably yeah. looks older, but yeah. I don't give a. You don't fuck. want to see her on 4K. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, you, you don't want to see her. On, uh, she probably looks a little different Sunday morning after a night of drinking. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She probably doesn't drink to yeah, stay looking yeah, like yeah. that. Exactly. You eat fucking nothing kale but, shakes. Nothing but Earl, yeah. Earl Grey tea. Earl Grey tea. You're doing and garlic water. cleanses. Water. <laughs> coffee you're, enemas. Yeah, I was gonna say you gotta be cleansing your rectum too. The, oh, the, the coffee enema. <laughs> it's just talk. To- she's isn't, toxin free. Have you ever done it? No, but isn't every coffee in I'm gonna, enema? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna do a coffee enema one of these days. I want to do it. That's the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, yeah I'm gonna do it. Because I've you, I've heard interesting things about it. I'm gonna try it. Where have you where do you buy this at? Where you just go buy a fucking Star- local Starbucks. What? Yeah. <laughs> I just don't want to stuff anything on my ass. That's yeah, what it'd I'm be weird. Yeah. Cause especially because you can fucking like lay on your bathroom floor and just feed it. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> You yeah. really, literally you do. I've seen diagrams of how you have Wait, to do oh it. Oh my goodness! You like, got to do it in the tub though, right? Huh? You got to do this in the tub. Yeah, you sh- if you have a tub, yeah. yeah. But if you don't, you're you know, on your tile floor, yeah. hoping you don't leak. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You got you to you raise your ass so like it, it goes down. Wait, wait, wait. I mean, I you're just... literally you're you shove you feed a tube into your ass and then you have to hold it and pour the fucking coffee into the like so, a beer bong. Like bong. Yeah, like a beer bong. <laughs> it's it's a, it's a beer bong for your ass yeah. and then you have to hold it in. Well, Steve-O did it with an actual beer. Yeah. <laughs> the hardest part is holding it in. You hold it in? Yeah. yeah. But yeah. how did it just went through and it? I don't know. No, you hold, no. you hold it for a little bit, and then you, and then you shit it you out. You just like, go through yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's disgusting. It's not pleasant. Who's, yeah, I don't know. Fuck these it's people. It's like, it's, like you, it's like you got drunk and ate a California burrito at 2 o'clock in the morning, and then you shit the next morning. Yeah, that's like, what those, it's like. like, I remember for a little while, colon cleansing was like a thing. Like, yeah. chicks would go in and do it, and that's what they were doing. You don't basically, you lose 10 you Basically, pounds? it's like sticking a hose in your ass and then washing out your insides and having it come back out. So uh, apparently these girls I went to high school with, um, they would like go in their friend's hot tub and like get the jet to shoot up their ass. <laughs> That's like, these are my kind of chicks. <laughs> yeah, right? And uh, and then they would go like go run to the bathroom and just shit and that was like their their enema. <laughs> I immediately retract that statement. <laughs> yeah. And yep. one and one of them couldn't make it into the house and like it went like shit in between the hot tub and the and the house. Good. I hope she's embarrassed for us for like there's pictures on Facebook. Yo, I know some college kids had died because that's the that's the way they were drinking. They were doing beer bongs up Oh yeah. If, if you if you put the wrong stuff up your ass, yeah. you could yeah. like, I heard like after three beers, I was like there was like dying. Three well, really yeah. Ooh, that's weren't funny. weren't people pouring vodka in their eye or some shit like that? Like, what the fuck? Can't you assholes just get drunk like normal people? Or vaping vodka. People can you vape oh, alcohol. Yeah. Well, it's like yeah. Sambuca. What happened, to sh- yeah. what happened to shots? I mean, call me old fashioned, but <laughs> we're, fuck. We're, we're, weren't you the one talking about fucking inhaling Sambuca? <laughs> yeah, no, that's what you used to, No, what you do, you do pour the shot of Sambuca and then you it's flammable, so you light it on fire, then you cover it, and then you let the fucking fumes like Fester for a bit, and then you inhale the fumes and do the shot. <laughs> so, what if the fumes really do anything? I don't think so. Huh? I mean, kill brain cells, but beyond that, no. <laughs> I'm sure it causes an aneurysm years later. Yeah, <laughs> I, I'm just so scared of dying. There's so much shit out there. People dropping dead left. I and thought right. about that oh, the yeah. other day. I'm like, fuck, people, like, you really do need to appreciate being alive. Because if you fucking make it through every day of your life, you know how many things could conceivably kill you in any fucking given Dude, second? Get, getting rear ended. I fucking. 
got rear-ended by a big ass fucking Ram okay. fi- F one fifty. I'm just or not F one fifty, uh Ram fifteen hundred. You or whatever. also drive a, a fucking matchbox car. Yeah. Well I'm just saying, like <laughs> it, he, that guy easily could have been going like fifty yeah. miles an hour and yeah. Well just think about inside your body what could go wrong yeah. in any fucking moment. Dude. I know th- I know that chick that uh tried to help those people that had that accident on the freeway and she got hit. Oh, was and that yeah. Oh, the that one was, not far from here yeah. on the 94? Yeah. That was, yeah, what, three weeks ago? Yeah. You know her? No, no, but I, um, it was my friend's friend's sister, actually. Oh, no. Yeah. And man. so what, was it a drunk driver that hit her? Or she yeah. Was, fuck, man. Wait, was it at night? Mm-hmm. Dude, yeah, there was, there was a, wrong, a wrong way crash. Like, last night or the night before, they hit a fucking fire engine. The dude died. Damn. Really? Yeah, dude died. Was it? Was it just? That's because the, the fucking fireman got out and beat him up. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> dude, they got immunity. They, they don't give a they fuck. They were like, I, I just, I hear that so often though. Like wrong way crowd. Like how the, fu- how are you that fucked up, dude? Like we've all done dumb shit and gotten behind the fucking wheel, and I have never like done I've, anything along I, those lines. I have lines. a friend of mine who's been on the show a while back was like notorious for driving drunk. And twice in my life, I got in the car not realizing he was fucked up, and I like had to like jump out of the fucking car. Like that's how dangerous he you was. Fucking tuck and roll. <laughs> yeah, like legit. Like I like as soon as he was slow down, you got to fucking open the door and jump out. Fuck and like yeah. he dude, he would be like whipping around corners, going nah, over I'm medians, out. like intentionally. Yeah. Like not like he was blacked out and could barely fucking move. Like he was fucked up, and he's like, I'm just gonna get fucking wild. <laughs> and, yeah, like, do it by yourself. Dude, Give one, me a one, one time he was gonna drive us to fucking TJ. And we go, we all got in the car, and then like immediately we realized he was fucked up. And like the first point he stopped, we all fucking jumped out of the car. <laughs> one, two, three, go. Yeah. What were you gonna say? You got all excited for oh, a second. Oh, uh, I was with my brother once, and this is like two, three Christmases ago, maybe. And uh, uh, he used to live up in the Bay Area, and uh, uh, we were up there, and uh, we we're hanging out with this guy. We had some beers. Anyway, so then we're walking back to the to where he his apartment, and this guy lives in like two apartments down from him, but he knows him from high school, so they're mm-hmm. friends, you know. So we're walking down, uh, we can tell us, you know, peace out to the guy. Uh, the next morning, uh, he, my brother gets a phone call. That guy from his house, his like ten, maybe not even ten minutes, got an Uber, uh, um, you know, to go see his girlfriend, and he, on the freeway, a a, a, guy, uh, a guy entered on the exit. And fucking killed the Uber driver and the guy. Damn. Like 10 minutes after we saw him. Like, jeez. See, I'm wondering, though, because usually whenever I hear about those, someone dies. Like, are you not seeing it? Because I would think, like, I don't know, maybe it, it, random shit happens. But it, I feel like if you saw headlights coming at you, like, I'm getting the fuck out but, of the but way. But what, you turn this way and then they turn the same way. Yeah. Like, what? I mean, I know how it could happen. It's it just chicken. seems crazy. It's like back in the 50s movies when they would yeah, <laughs> like drive the cars idiots. towards each other. <laughs> what those, kind of those, shit is those, that? Those, <laughs> steal, those steal death traps, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that was before they had coffee enemas and fucking decided to pour vodka in That you. glass was made for death. Yeah, <laughs> literally. And just breaking the shards. Yeah. Yeah. Your head off. <laughs> yeah, Jake, you fucking slit your jugular, dude. No, no airbags, heavy ass fucking cars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder what year they figured out that the car should crumple, not the in- not the, the person. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> not that it shouldn't turn into a flying spear. Yeah. Like, I don't know though. Those old fucking classic cars though, they're built like fucking. They're built brick but, shit houses. but they yeah. don't take any of the impact. Oh no, no. So you die. everything breaks. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Like you die. They don't absorb anything. Yeah, yeah it just yeah. cracks and snaps. So what was that? The nineties, late. Maybe oh, mid nineties they figured it out. I think they, airbags were like yeah late eighties early nineties. The airbags don't mean shit. I mean like oh the like the crumple factor. Yeah, oh. you know you know what still throws me off is states that don't have seatbelt laws like uh, like Arizona. Yes, yeah. freedom. Like dude, I, I, I like <laughs> so it, sick it, of seatbelts. And, and it throws me off because I have, I have a friend that lives out in Arizona and he like in you know you'd be out drinking. Like, oh, I'm gonna come pick you up, and then he would come pick pick us up. And I forget he has a truck, and there's like six of us, and he's like, "Oh, just hop, hop in the, in the hop in the bed, yep. yeah." And I'm like, "What the fuck are you talking about?" I'm like, "Oh, fuck, it's Arizona. They want you to die out hey, here." You can <laughs> fucking <laughs> open carry anywhere yeah. in Arizona. It's just, not difficult either. Dude, I can't tell you how many times I'd be like in a fucking uh, Jack in the Box drive-through in Scottsdale, like pissing off the fucking the bed out, out the bed of a truck at like two <laughs> in the great. morning. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. I know in Texas they don't have um, helmets for motorcycles. Helmet laws. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's great. That's fucking. That's great. It's dude, great. Dude, I mean, he's got a point. Like, I understand why they would want to regulate it for safety's sake. But if you want to go on your fucking bike without a helmet and risk dying of a head injury, that's your choice. Yep. Until somebody else hits you and they have to live with the fact they killed somebody on him. No, motorcycle. you weren't wearing a helmet. You yeah. fucking idiot. <laughs> dude, I, I, see, I feel bad for like two and a half minutes and I'm like, ah, well. I, 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 see, when I, when I see people riding in PB with a helmet and like basketball shorts and a t-shirt. Yeah. I'm like, bro, you're gonna slide that fucking thing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that, that nylon fucking. Yeah. 
What half cotton? Dude, dude right? all yeah, the yeah, injuries yeah. for motorcycles are to your legs. All of them. Yeah. All of them. Almost. I mean, when people die, obviously, but like most of it is the uh, road rash. If you get road rash to the bone, they amputate from wherever it is because they can't heal. That might have changed in the last couple of years. That's like Oof. a ten year old stat. I'm sure they got some like graph or yeah, some shit. Right? <laughs> <laughs> probably fucking. Yeah. I mean, they have like mo- I've seen like the some people have like the serious safety gear where it's like you have like the metal in the boots, like yeah, all kinds of like, pa- like padding. So you and can shit. slide, yeah. and chill, yeah, and then hopefully, and hopefully you don't go through an intersection and a car blasts you from the other side. <laughs> Yeah, that'll get you. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I can tell you right now, gr- uh, being on Grand, there's not a day goes by that you don't hear fucking screech. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> really, I bet. Every yeah. fucking like day, people dude. people just getting rear-ended? Rear-ended, car, I've seen cars flip over, fucking all kinds of shit. I know, shit. a guy who died on a motorcycle right by your house. Like really? somewhere like within a block or two. Was it recently? No, no, this was like five years ago, maybe. Did, Did they, he get T-boned? The, uh, yes, yeah, actually. There, no, no, no. Some, well, he T boned the guy. Yeah, yeah that's the guy. what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There Usually was, with a motorcycle, motorcycle, like yeah. you hit the fuck, but yeah. at, you're going at such a fucking fast yeah. speed and rate of oh. speed that as soon as you hit yeah. it, your neck just <sighs> snapped your neck. Um, there was like a one month period where somebody got shot outside of Bar West, which is like a block away from I my remember place. That, yeah. And then, like, a, literally, like in that same month, some dude got stabbed outside of uh, like the. Uh, tavern like Trader Joe's area right there. Hell yeah. 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 Well, he cut his ass. <laughs> you ever heard that dude got shot downtown? He was like, uh, he had a gun on Fifth Street. He ha- he had a gun yeah, on Fifth Street. Like he was brandishing was it, a gun? Was it, was it Plaxico Burris shooting himself? <laughs> no, 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 no. no, no. <laughs> you just brought up a name from like 2003. Holy yeah. shit. Wait, speaking of how, that. How could you ever forget a guy who brought a gun to a nightclub and shot himself? I mean, that's like. I just saw a fucking article that some dude shot himself in the groin in a Walmart. I mean, you know, yeah. that, that's typical Walmart. Yeah. <laughs> Did you ever see? There's a there's, appendix carry. There's a video of a dude doing that. He I I don't remember where it was. It was somewhere in like, like a pseudo police station, if you yeah. will, something like that. And you see him like just walking over, and you hear it, and he just looks down. He's like, "Fuck." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't imagine how that would feel. I saw a guy putting it, it back in his holster. He was like showing somebody something, and then he's like, put it back in his holster, and it just got caught on his yeah. t-shirt, and boom, shot himself in the leg. Damn. Oops. My first thought would be about my dick. Forget my leg. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, I mean, hope you don't hit your fucking artery. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> is like, that your femoral, the one that runs yeah, your yeah, yeah, yeah. On the inside. And then and then they, they got you on a table, like, fucking Black Hawk down. Hell your yeah. wife has got her teeth, and she's trying Hell to yeah. fucking grab yeah, it. Yeah, that's, that's, the that's, <laughs> that's where the blood the is just going, like, <laughs> 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 like, literally hitting the yeah. fucking ceiling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mm-mm. Well, that was. Fun. I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we've touched NFL, NBA. What yeah. else we got? <laughs> I, I, by the way, that movie Black Hawk Down. I I can watch the first like uh, maybe like hour, and then I skip like 20 minutes, or maybe even more like 30 minutes, and I can watch the end. I hate. There's that middle section in there with the guy dying, and, yeah. and they're just sitting around being sad. I'm like, I don't want to watch this. Kill Africans. Yeah. <laughs> Kill them. Kill them all. <laughs> Pop their grapes. Get the skitties. Get the skitties. Get the skitties. <laughs> Put those chem lights. Let's fucking go with the choppers already. <laughs> oh, shit, man. Get the skitties. Jesus Christ. Speaking of choppers, that meme with the fucking crab where it said, when you see a helicopter playing fucking Creedence Clearwater, oh, yeah, fucking... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> What the and you're a, and you're a Vietnamese rice farmer. Yeah, yeah Vietnamese He's rice like, farmer. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fortunate son, that was the song. Because I pictured it, I'm like, oh, that's good. It's so good. Yeah. That's every fucking uh, Vietnamese <laughs> or what is it, uh, Vietnam War movie ever. Yeah, I love it. In the Hueys with fucking CCR on the speaker. <laughs> but it's such an iconic scene. When you hear that song, you see Vietnam, mm-hmm. or at least I do. Like. Cause I, every Vietnam movie ever, pretty much, right? Has as that soon song. as that first chord is strummed, I'm like, oh yeah, these nams. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> or that other one from uh, Apocalypse Now. You know when they're in the movie theater? And, I haven't uh, seen that movie in so. They're long. watching like those. They're watching something. Oh, like the they're watching like the videos of the attacks or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah they're yeah. watching and there's that like I think it's a cavalry song yeah, yeah. or something. Da, 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Every time I hear it, and they're like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Such a crazy scene. Such, I wonder if that actually happened. Probably. Probably. There's probably like a well. There's like the the moment where you go, you're pumped up, and you're going into Vietnam, and then there's like the return where you're fucked up. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's everything when it comes to military like, stuff, or go, <laughs> or even Vegas. Like, yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah that too. Like expectation versus reality. That well, too. Not even just expectation versus reality. It's just like it fucking 
beats the hell out of you, and then yeah. you're coming back, and you're like, oh, fuck this shit. And you got to go back to the real thing, the yeah. life. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I haven't been to Vegas are, in so long. Are, assholes are lighting off fireworks down, <laughs> down the yeah. street. Yeah. Fucking. <laughs> I was just in Vegas uh, for Thanksgiving for a couple of days. It was like a week. I Visiting was. our friend? Yeah, yeah, it was fun. It's fun. I do. I really like Vegas. Did, did you hit the buffet for Thanksgiving dinner? Fuck no. You're gonna move to Vegas, aren't you? No, no, no. no. <laughs> I don't think I can live there. Although you can drink in the car if you're a passenger. Freedom. I didn't know that. For any car? <laughs> Freedom. Yeah, you can just. Chill you can car. still do it. I mean, like cabs here and shit. Right. If California yeah. continues no. on the path that it is, I, Vegas looks pretty damn fucking it's appealing. Fucking taxes. What? Everything's burning down. <laughs> Earthquakes. <laughs> fucking landslides. Hepatitis C Hep- downtown. Yeah. Hepatitis C. They're talking about a TB outbreak Jeez. down here in San Diego. What? Really? Yeah. The border. All the Mexicans trying to get in. Oh, they're not <laughs> even Mexican. They're Honduran. <laughs> they're from like three thousand miles away. What are they doing Same here? Thing. <laughs> racist, <laughs> racist, <laughs> fucking Brazilians fighting all over Point Loma. This place is fucking nuts. Hell in a handbag. <laughs> Hell in a handbag. Yeah. I mean, just think there's gonna be another. And the fucking Irish come here every summer too. <laughs> the Irish, the Irish. They come here drink and annoy everybody. Yeah, the, I just watched those Korean store owners from the '90s shooting people off their roof <laughs> during the LA riots. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, well, what is going on here? This place sucks. <laughs> people dying every day. How did you happen to be watching these videos? We're on YouTube. I've watched. I watch everything. <laughs> I know you do. If it hits the internet, I see it. <laughs> I am the internet. I have seen all of the internet the internet has to offer. <laughs> he, he gets updates when there's something new on the internet. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. On like the way. Like RSS feed. Like yeah. there's something new. Everything. Something yeah. new on the internet. <laughs> yep. And I just download it into my head. I just watched uh, some, I think it was Los Zetas. Yeah. The, one of those cartels, you know, in Mexico. Yeah. And uh, there's this female, this motorcycle pulls up. Female assassin gets off the motorcycle. Shit, uh, six shots, six dead. Shut Just up. Boom, 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 boom. That's hot. You think Back she, on the motorcycle, you, she's you, going. I know. You, you think she's on Tinder? Ass was fat. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. The Dude, ass was fat. That, what, was, it the mo- was it the motorcycle pants, though, or was it? No, no. She has some nice jeans on. She has some heels, too. Who long can't? black hair. Really? Wait, she this did is, it on heels? Pop, pop, pop. This yeah, is an actual this, video? There's an actual video on YouTube, yeah. She's get, and, and there, you can tell she, she knows what she's doing. Like, just bam, 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 bam. And they just drop, 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 drop. Six dead. Back on the motorcycle. That's so hot. Think. Why yeah. is that so hot to me? <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm serious. Like, holy yeah. shit. Boy, she comes boy, in boy, here. Boy, boy, boy. Yeah, by the way. <laughs> she's like, oh, my bop, God. Bop, bop, bop. By the way, you don't ever want to marry into a crime family. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, that shit don't end well. Yeah, it's hot until you get killed. Yeah, right? It's like the crazy shit. I need to look this up later. Yeah, I'll, I, got, I saw the video. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, it's fucking new. Narc- there's a, the Narcos Mexico is on Netflix. You got to watch that. Oh yeah. yeah, that's true. By the way, we're sponsored by Narcos. No, <laughs> <laughs> that would be sick. That would be sick. <laughs> you know what I heard is that they, I think the reason they did Mexico is because, um, oh, what's his name, family in, Col- in Colombia, uh, basically like threatened them to kill them if they tried to film again in Colombia. Really? Yeah. I mean, Escobar's family. Yeah. Fair enough. When you put your airing out all this fucking shit. Yeah. How many fucking <laughs> like, movies? Oh, you're ruining Pablo Escobar's name. <laughs> <laughs> he seemed like a good guy to me. I mean, if he didn't do that terrorist shit, he'd yeah. be all right. If he didn't do that terrorist and kill all those people, you yeah. know, yeah. He's a good guy. Yeah, seems like an all right chap. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, he's the world's greatest boss. Yeah. He made a lot of people rich, I'm just saying. <laughs> a lot of people got paid. A lot of people got paid. I, there's got to be money still buried oh, somewhere, Oh, for right? sure. Let's yeah. go. Yeah. I wonder how much money is buried out there of all currency, not just U.S. In Colombia? No, just in the world. Oh. Just like, you know, it's lost. It, it probably doesn't last long, though. Fair Wait. enough. Or let's say gold coins. Like, you know, there's some, like... What, a pirate's booty? Yeah, sure, <laughs> sure. sure. <laughs> Me treasure, yeah. Our <laughs> mateys. <laughs> sure, I don't give a fuck. Just like, uh, wait, what's that, um, uh... What's the movie Indiana Jones? Yes, like you know when they go in somewhere and it's just like coins and we need yeah, to orchestrate you know? a drunk treasure hunt. <laughs> Dude, it'd be so much fun. We're, we'll get Nick Cage, National Treasure. <laughs> yeah, Hell I yeah. think that shit's so fun. Treasure hunting, that'd treasure. be so much fun. There used to be an app. It was actually pretty fun. This is gonna sound like the dumbest thing ever, but it's actually pretty fun. Uh, you could, it was like geolocate like treasure, and it would just give you like a uh, like geocaching that that I, thing. I can't remember the name. It might have been. I don't was know. It, was it was it was it kind of like the Pokemon? <laughs> a <laughs> little bit, but like. More more real life and you know you no, actually that's have ge- sex that, and that's this. geocaching though like maybe like people would hide something somewhere and then you get a bunch of fucking coordinates you gotta go yeah, find it exactly yeah yeah, yeah. what and if there's like a fighting app where you would go and fight like five people <laughs> Ooh, I like that idea I like that idea million dollar idea right there Mi- for trillion, trillion dollar 
it's a, it's a app of fucking people just beating up the fight. Yeah. yeah. I, I mean, you, you sign a contract on the app. Just Dude, immediately. You, you, you can sign up all these MMA gyms and be like, hey, we're going to set this app just to fight people. Yeah. <laughs> with cameras. You, know, you can just use your phone. Everyone's Street phones. fight. Street fight. It'd be like 3D with all the cameras. Tekken. Real life Tekken. Ooh, I like it. Did you see the fucking, like, that kindergarten that had a little fight club with the kids or some shit a couple weeks Were ago? Were yeah. teachers running it? <laughs> yeah. What? Yes. This is prison? <laughs> were, were, were people betting on it? That's what I want to I don't know. think so. I just saw something fucking. There were some teachers that did some creepy fucking shit when I look back on it now. Like With you? No, not with me. But with, <laughs> <laughs> no, God, no. no, I wasn't that dumb. <laughs> um, no, like we, we were, uh, there's this, uh, this teacher I had when I was in like seventh grade something, and he always hung out with, with students in like a really weird, unacceptable way. Like now people would really flag it and be like, yo, dude, you got to stop. Yeah. But um, we had one of my friends' uh, dads actually went up to him one day. He's like, "You gotta like chill out and not like hang what out the with fuck the students." Was he doing? Like weird. Ch- I remember I was at uh, Home Depot with my dad one day, and we were in like the garden section, and I saw, I saw him with a, with a female student who was like probably like I, I had already moved on to high school at this point, so she was probably like three years younger than, like, than me. She's like thirteen. Yeah, or like thirteen or something. And he was like there shopping with her, and my dad was like, "What the." F- fuck is going on like that's, that's weird. fucking weird yeah, that's it was a saturday too it wasn't like after school going to get something for the classroom like no no no. it was like it was a weekend day like there's no fucking reason for it saturday morning like they just woke up yeah like they got, <laughs> like, 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 like they got brunch <laughs> mimosas mimosas yeah bloody bloody mary's virgin mimosas, virgin that mimosas. <laughs> that's so creepy like I don't, I don't want to be around anyone's kid at all. No. Yeah. Like if Fuck adults no. are like if they're not in the room, yeah, like, okay, yeah, I'm yeah. out of here. I, held I my, don't even I, like I, kids anyway. Yeah. What the fuck would I hate one? In like out the five days back home, I held my niece like twice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then people always get weird about that. Like, don't you want to hold a? No. no. Uh-uh. Yeah. Oh, it was your kid. It, it was great. She has separation anxiety from my uh, from my. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. So like, as soon as my like my my sister in law would hand her over, she would start crying. So I'm yeah. like, oh, yeah, here, well, you here you go. You can have her back. Fair enough. Yeah. Yeah, I just got comfortable being around my buddy's kid. He's 16 now. Now he's like an adult. Yeah. So like, I don't, I don't care. Like, just hanging if out. I, if I have a kid, <laughs> bring him back when he's 18. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I remember when he's like 12. I'm like, he's too small. I don't want him around me. Like, yeah. I don't, I don't want. I, I don't know. I don't. You can get accused of anything that's over. Dude, it's like those. It's like those. Uh, that guy who was, um, who was like babysitting for uh, some white kids, and the black dude had the cops called in oh, on yeah. him. He's stealing kids. Yeah. yeah right. I mean, was he stealing kids? Or? Well, maybe. <laughs> No, he was like he ran like a church group, and he was like babysitting for his friend's kids or some He'd shit like, like that. He's like done it for years too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. And they like it was super sad. They were like pulling the kid. They got the kids out of the car, and they were like questioning them, like, "Do you know this guy? Like, what are you doing with him? Dude, like, how weird. fucking insulting is that?" It's the, I saw that. That was fucked up. Uh, did you any of you guys see that fucking video? It was making the rounds a little while ago of this chick. She like was getting tired of fucking people flying by the school bus that would stop in front of her house every day and flash the red lights and people wouldn't fucking pay any heed to it. Please like, tell me she got no, an AR dude, and just started. No, no, light. no. Worse. Okay. The worst thing. <laughs> so she notified the police department because she made all these complaints. So the video that she's taking is of her like walking. I know she's some fat white chick. You can just tell, dude. You can tell her she's jowls fucking, are flat. No, you can't see. You can just if yeah. you hear it. It reminded it's like, me. It's like barbecue Becky. I immediately <laughs> thought of that fucking chick that's screaming about the bear attacking her kayak. Cause like so you see the cars pass the fucking bus and then the cops pull out two cops and then they basically said all of you pull over so there's like 12 people pulling over and she's like that's what you get you need to stop and just oh I, my god furious i hate just that. listening to this dude. I, this, this is why i hate the suburbs dude. and then I, the I comments just, are like just... that's right those people deserve yeah. to get tickets i was i was just in the suburbs for thanksgiving man like my me and my dad were driving back uh back to the house and he's going like maybe 30 35 on this long straight you know, residential road, but it's not like, it's not like the the, the there's it's super a, skinny or something like that. Yeah, yeah. it's a, it's yeah. A, it's, a, it's, a, it's like a big thoroughfare through the through the neighborhood. Right. Like there's room to stop if a kid were to dart out. Well, it's also one of the busier roads where no kids would be in yeah, the street. Yeah. Like where like know, the speed limit could be fifty, 50. and it wouldn't yeah, even matter. Exactly. Right. Yeah. And like, and you know, we're driving in in, it's like this you know mom type you know SUV we're in, so it's not like it's like a fast car or anything. And we're driving, and this guy's walking with his kid on the sidewalk, and he just, like, raises his arms at my dad. And yeah, I'm like, yeah. dude, get the fuck out of here, man. Like, He's a white guy, huh? Yeah, oh, of course, of course. yeah. yeah. 
I, a total, I, total dad move. I, dr- I drive like a fucking old grandma, and I've had like yeah. people like slow down. Yeah. Like, Bro, I'm going yeah. 27. What the fuck? Are There's we talking a, about? my friend lived in a gated community, and there were like these track homes in the gated community that weren't like the big custom homes, and they were on these like, they were on the side of the gated community, and the way you would get there, you'd go off the main road and you would turn left. And then you would have to immediately turn left or right into a little cul-de-sac. And then you would have to turn again immediately. So it was like three quick turns. And uh, and I went over to my friend's house one day and, and his neighbor comes over and tells uh, his mom, that guy right there was going like 60 miles an hour around the corner. I'm like, I would end up in your fucking living room. Yeah, impossible. <laughs> like, impossible like to go the, that fast. The only way a car is going over like 30 doing that is if it's an F1 race car. Yeah, <laughs> if, I'm, if I'm drifting. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, or a drift car. Yeah, yeah, Danica Patrick would have yeah. to be like behind the wheel. Speaking of drifting, man, there's a dude that was getting on the freeway and he just busted this sick ass fucking drift. I saw that. Yeah, that, that was, was fucking, sick. I was like, damn, man. That's <laughs> All tight. the way around. Yeah, I was like, oh, man, I want to oh, do that. Oh, is it like man. a curved on ramp? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. badass. All the way. And you have to design your car to drift, right? Right? Yeah. Do you? I thought I could yeah. just. I thought all you need is a real, real drive no. and an e-brake. <laughs> this is we're gonna, we're, go. gonna, we're gonna fast forward to the next episode, and Dom's like, "Man, I fucking totaled my car." <laughs> <laughs> Brand new car, fucking wrapped it around a tree. How's the new ride, by the way? I like it, man. It's cool. Yeah, yeah, enjoying it. It's not as good as on gas as I thought. Dirt. It was What'd you be. get? Dirt, dirt. Tell, tell, tell you everyone. Got, you got Dirty Mike in the boys' yeah. car. I got a uh, four series. Look at you. Look at you. Look, look, look at, at you. you. Let's go drift. Fuck, <laughs> man. I'm with it. And it Does it have in? paddles or what? It's got paddle shifters. Does yeah. it? Yeah. Look at this what's, motherfucker right here. What's that called? Right uh, ste- trip, tripnotic or yeah, steptronic yeah. or whatever? It's got that Which option, too. It? It's yeah. got uh, four four modes. That DJ money. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> money. Is, there, is there no clutch or anything? What's that? Is there no clutch? Or yeah, no, there's no clutch. No clutch, okay. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, Damn! Yeah. Put in that sport plus. Wait, mode. but it's the paddle shifting. Like you don't have to use the paddle shifters, right? It's you got don't. a fucking a shifter. No, yeah? no, no, no. It's only shifting. paddle shifting or trick tonic. That trick tonic. Oh, okay. Shit. Yeah. Where you, you basically go up and down. Yeah. That, they are some fancy stuff. Yeah. Trick-tonic. That thing got a hemi. Yeah. <laughs> and that, that old Beamer got a hemi. <laughs> Remember those fucking commercials? <laughs> It was the Dodge Hemis or whatever. Yeah, <laughs> that thing got a hammy. That thing got a hammy. I did like that fucking tweet where the guy was like, what, what was he he's comparing automatic with manual fucking drivers? And he's like, manual, I make love to my vehicle. I fucking <laughs> shove the shifter in my ass. When my car goes, I go. <laughs> and then like he said, automatic. Guys, I drive an automatic. <laughs> By the way, I love driving stick shift, but when you're stuck in traffic, it is fucking yeah, miserable. I think that's or the dri- biggest downfall. Or yeah. driving in San Francisco on the yeah. fucking hills. Oh, yeah, those fuck. I always felt like that was kind of fun though, just because it was like it was like a challenge. It was you always know? like see how fun. <laughs> well, you just got to think about it. You yeah. got to be on point. You can't just be spacing out. You know, that's e-brake. when you use the e brake. Yeah. yeah, but yeah, it is true though. Manual people who drive manual love to fucking jerk off. They like most people. Well, actually, I don't know if that's true anymore. Can most people drive manual? No. Now, no. I, told you, I would when, venture when, to say it's probably less I was, than thirty percent. When I, when I was working at a hotel, there were multiple people who were supposed to valet cars that didn't know how to drive a, a stick. I feel like. I mean, maybe they're just not that common. Anymore. It's something that you should. Yeah, I heard they're, they're not, not that common. Yeah. yeah. Even but when I was getting my car, they were they're not at all. I, I thought they were stick shift, stick. and they're like, we don't, they don't really make those. They're like more expensive no more. now. Uh. Remember, didn't automatic used to be more expensive? Yeah, they're, they're cheaper to a manual is cheaper to fix. Yeah. Because there's less going on. And they don't break it often. I don't know. That's Unless, fucking... um, I remember I t- was teaching some girl in high school how to drive a stick in my car, and she was grinding the fucking gears, oh, grinding yeah. the clutch. Get her out of there. Get, get out. After like one minute, I was like, no, get off, the fuck off, out yeah. of here. Off, off, yeah. <laughs> 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 off, 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 off. Yeah, I guess it's just not that common, so that, that makes sense. But maybe that's only here, though. I bet in other countries it's pretty common. Like Russia? Yeah, like, well, I mean, they're still driving cars from fucking like 60s. Like Cuba. Like, <laughs> yeah, oh, my God. That's actually kind of cool, though. That's I the know, only was, thing about that, it. That place is, like, stuck in time. Yeah, it's like uh-huh. Cuba. Yeah. Like, if you've never seen videos of Cuba or whatever. But they all, all, all not all the cars, but a lot wow. of the cars are before, like, 68 Yeah, or it was, yeah. what was it called? Like, the, the memory capsules or whatever? Yeah. That's, like, basically what Cuba was. Yeah. And they would have, they have people who make the parts there. Yeah, Because yeah. They, you can't, they don't make the parts anywhere else. Yeah, which so is if, fucking cool. Yeah. Because, like, a lot of the cars are actually upkept very well. Yeah. You know. The then, one cool thing and, about and then, Cuba, yeah. and then they start like putting my, like supersonic sounds into your ears, so yeah. that <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. everything has its down, yeah, you know, downside. You know. <laughs> but the black beans and rice, fire, <laughs> some tostones, fuego. <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, uh, boys. Yeah. Uh, we're we're gonna we're gonna do no more shows. Lies. He fucking Lies. don't that. even say no, it exactly. anymore. We're to, what do you mean? Up. So what? Next shows in three months? I don't, no, you, I'm just saying. You, you hey, tell me. hey, thanks for watching. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're, we're gonna do one for each night of Hanukkah. Yeah. <laughs> so every show is just a mini series, and then it's over. Yeah. Then, so you gotta wait till next mini exactly. series. <laughs> it's like The Walking Dead. You gotta wait yeah. till like next fall. No, for the fuck fucking... that. We're like curb your enthusiasm. We come back when we want. Yeah. Ooh, I like that. Yeah, fuck you guys. <laughs> Larry David and this bitch. But do appreciate all the support. Though. Yeah, seriously. And, uh, and all the messages. Yep. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. And send me fuck Scoob. I think that's yeah. funny. Did you say send me fuck Scoob? Yeah, I mean, it gets said all the time anyway. Or it'll be random, just like in a comment, or uh, respond to something, and underneath it will just put fuck Scoob. Hey, you get, get it, fuck it, get it tattooed. Yeah, ooh, I'll get, I'll get it tattooed if you get it tattooed. Will you though? But I mean, I'll, I'll hide it. Somewhere. We'll give I'll you like, a free T-shirt if you get fuck scoop tattoo. Oh man, I hope this guy can, is can listening you, to the can podcast. You, can you get a tramp stamp? <laughs> Dude, there's a guy real quick. There's a guy at my gym who got uh, savage as fuck tattooed across his face. Shut oh, up. No. Now is he's it a Takashi professional. Six nine. No, oh, we didn't talk about that. Man. He's a professional fighter, but still, it says savage AF across his fucking head. Like you know, like yeah. yeah. Mike Tyson really started that trend. It's like, what? What do you do? Yeah, but when you're Mike Tyson, you do whatever the fuck you want. Well, yeah. When when, when you're on tape saying, "I'll uh, uh, fuck you till you love me, faggot." Yeah. Know, like, <laughs> it was, a, his was just it's it's just a design. You, you, you got the words. worst the worst design. Whatever you yeah. got you got words that, that on your face. Savage <laughs> one, and then as fuck too. Your Nike's not calling anymore. <laughs> Adidas doesn't want anything to do with you. Well, Under like, Armour is not going to sponsor you. They're done. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We're out. <laughs> Have there been any good messages recently? I know uh, you reposted yeah, one the on the fucking. Oh, yeah, all oh, the angry ones. Yeah, uh, only when I have time. I, I do that. Yeah, there's always angry ones. Oh, Nothing that stands out, though. And we didn't, even, so fucking we didn't even touch on the outing of Tot, tot Tax or whatever. Oh, yeah, the Tot Audit. The tot Audit. audit. Tot, tot, yeah. tot Audit. We'll. We, we'll Next time, next year, we'll do yeah. that one. <laughs> <laughs> For spring, our yeah. annual spring show. Yeah, we'll talk about that after tax season. Yeah, after <laughs> when it makes when it absolutely has no fucking bearing on anything. It makes no sense. They're like, look, what is Instagram? Yeah, <laughs> what is Snapchat? Yeah. that's been out of business for six months. We're like Snapchat. Oh. Are you sure? Man, hey. Well, uh, Let's do this, man. Uno. Hey. Dos. Dos. Hey. Tres. Okay.